Higher fees for less classes, higher fees for less teachers, less options, less opportunity for success. After a decade of being Christmas, this budget is the latest battle in a war on students, the poor, and the CSU master plan, and we cannot let corporations or the rich win this fight. for too long. For over a decade, students and faculty have been taxed to fix the problems created in Sacramento. Let's do a little history run. In 2001, the dot-com explosion lowered revenues, so students and faculty, you know, we chipped in. Two student fee increases later in 2003 when blackouts and brownouts caused a statewide energy crisis. Again, students and faculty, we did our part. Four fee increases later in 2007, the greedy CSU Board of Trustees gave themselves a raise while they raised our fees. Boo! 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 the Great Recession, they furloughed our campuses. Who's and now it? Republicans want an all-cuts budget? The CSU Master Plan has three central pillars. Affordability, uh, affordability, quality, and accessibility. Right? Sacramento Beach says 47% of students cannot get their classes. How is that accessible? Right? How is this affordable when every year we are getting fee increases? Doesn't make any sense, guys. A lot, right? I asked you, what the hell is going on with what our school? Our right? For over a decade, we have been taxed and feed. We've given our part to the state of California. Right. We, know, we know that any more budget cuts to this education system is going to make that CSU master plan nothing but a lie to the people of California. <laughs> What the hell? What the hell?